How are we doing tonight? Okay, new people, I'm not going to lie. Everybody's a little wound up because we are one week away from a major milestone in the Open Stage Project's history. We are, we are about to have an anniversary. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on that last night because next week is the one-year birthday of this madness. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I am, I am going to ask you to do me a favor. I'm going to ask you if, if you're new and you hate it, come back, give us one more try. No. Uh, if, if you're new and you love it, come back, bring a friend. It will, and if you've been here in the past, if you're watching on YouTube, next week is going to be a huge, huge party. And we really want everyone who's ever been a part of this to be a part of that. So please come out, okay? Yes? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you know... It, 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 you can't help but start taking stock. We don't keep score around here, but I, I did a while back talk about milestones. Um, I'm a big believer in, in kind of keeping score with yourself. Good things you've done, awesome things you've done, because they drive you forward. If you, if you get like level one accomplished, you can go for level two. I, I think that's good. I don't think that's a bad sort of keeping score. So I had a couple months back the most amazing experience in my life, and I thought I would never top it, and last weekend I did. Um, to, to go backwards for our new people, back in August, I auditioned for Ringling Brothers. And, yeah. and it went really well. And this community is what got me ready to be capable of even trying the extreme physicality of, of going for that. I thought that would be, I mean, they told me, you are amazing. Keep going, doing what you're doing. Um, you're too scary for kids. It's true, it's true, but, but keep doing what you're doing. We really like you, and it was, it, was, it was a big deal for me. And I thought, okay, that's it. That's all I need. That's the validation of a lifetime. I, ha I have found something that topped it, and I got to do it last weekend. About a month ago, and I've been, I've been sitting on this, so I'm vibrating. A month ago, I got a phone. <laughs> the pants hide it. About a month ago, I got a phone call from Cirque du Soleil. And last weekend, Marie Martin and I worked as part of the advanced promotions team for Kidam. I want to do two big things here. One, I want to shout out Cirque du Soleil started as street performance and built itself up to something internationally recognized. And I want to shout them out for going to every city they go, doing that necessary promotion, but engaging local performers and local talent to do those promotions. There is amazing circus in every city and they are hiring them and putting them to work and I thank you for that, I really do. We all do. And if you need more of us, all of these people have resumes, I can hook you up. Okay. And I don't know where to go from there because it's just like, wow. But local talent's been on my mind. We, we were very busy this weekend. I, I mentioned this is where the busy started. Last week I talked about this is where the busy started. We were also, the Circus Freaks were uh, asked to come out to a, a performer you might know, Vivian Vermouth. She held an event called the Showgirl Follies. Um, we, we attended that, we were part of that. We were, well, freaks at it. And, and we were a great part of that. We had so much fun that we invited her here later tonight. So she'll be joining us in just a little bit. Um, and a couple of our other performers this evening are all performers that were in that show. So I thought we'd start there. What do you think? <laughs> 